Hello and welcome to the session. The given question says, solve the following differential equation. And let's start with the solution. And the given equation is, y square minus x square into dy is equal to 3xy into dx. Or it can further be written as, on dividing both the sides by y square minus x square and dx. On the left hand side we have dy divided by dx and on the right hand side we have 3xy divided by y square minus x square. Now as we can see, this is a homogeneous function since the degree of the numerator is also 2 and the degree of the denominator is also 2. Therefore, putting y is equal to vx here. And first let us find its first derivative. It is equal to v plus x into dv divided by dx. So now substituting these two values in this equation. Let this be equation number 1. So 1 implies that on the left hand side we have v plus x into dv divided by dx is equal to 3 into x into vx whole divided by y square is v square x square minus x square. Or this is further equal to v plus x into dv divided by dx is equal to 3v divided by v square minus 1. Or this is further equal to x into dv divided by dx is equal to 3v divided by v square minus 1 minus v or we further have x into dv divided by dx is equal to, in the denominator we have v square minus 1, and here we have 3v minus v cube plus v. Or we further have x into dv divided by dx is equal to 4v, sorry, 3v plus v gives 4v, minus v cube divided by v square minus 1. Or this is further equal to v square minus 1 divided by v cube minus 4v is equal to minus dx divided by x. Or we further have v square minus 1 divided by taking v common. We are left here with v square minus 4 which can be written as v square minus 2 square and this is equal to minus dx divided by x or we have v square minus 1 divided by v into v minus 2 into v plus 2 and this is equal to minus dx divided by x. Now let us solve this by partial fraction. This can be written as v square minus 1 divided by v into v minus 2 into v plus 2 as a divided by v plus b divided by v minus 2 plus c divided by v plus 2. Or this is further equal to a to v square minus 4 plus b into v square plus 2v plus c into v square minus 2v divided by this whole v into v minus 2 into v plus 2. So in comparing this, we find here that v square minus 1 is equal to a plus b plus c v square. We have plus 2b minus 2c into v. Then we have minus 4a. And on comparing the constants, here we find that minus 1 is equal to minus 4a, which implies that a is equal to 1 by 4. Now from here, as we can see on the left hand side, we do not have any coefficient of v. Therefore, we have 2b minus 2c is equal to 0. So this implies that b is equal to c. And here, on comparing the coefficient of v square on both the sides, we get a plus b plus c is equal to 1 or we have here 
A as 1 by 4, B and C are equal. So we have 2 times of B is equal to 1 minus 1 by 4 which gives 3 by 4. This is further implies that B is equal to 3 by 8 and since B is equal to C, so C is also equal to 3 by 8. Therefore, it can further be written as A divided by V and here A is 1 by 4, so we have 1 by 4 divided by V plus B divided by V minus 2, B is 3 by 8, so we have 3 by 8 divided by V minus 2 plus C divided by V plus 2 and C is again 3 by 8 divided by V plus 2 and this is equal to minus dx divided by x. Now integrating both the sides. On the left hand side we have 1 by 4 integral 1 by v into dv plus 3 by 8 integral 1 upon v minus 2 into dv plus 3 by 8 integral dv divided by v plus 2 and this is equal to minus integral dx divided by x. All this is further equal to 1 by 4 log v plus 3 by 8 log v minus 2 plus 3 by 8 log v plus 2 is equal to minus log x plus log c. All this is further equal to 1 by 4 log v plus 3 by 8 taking common from these two terms we have log v minus 2 into log v plus 2 and this is equal to log v square minus 4 since log a plus log b is equal to log a into b. And on the right hand side we have minus log x plus log c. Or this is further equal to 1 by 4 log v plus 3 by 8 log v square minus 4 is equal to log of c divided by x. Or this can further be written as 1 by 4 log. Now, we had assumed that y is equal to vx in the beginning. So, v is equal to y divided by x. So, here we have y divided by x plus 3 divided by 8 log y square divided by x square minus 4 is equal to log c divided by x. Or we further have log y divided by x raised to the power 1 by 4 plus log y square divided by x square minus 4 raised to the power 3 by 8 is equal to log c divided by x or we have log y divided by x raised to the power 1 by 4 into y square divided by x square minus 4 raised to the power 3 by 8 is equal to log c divided by x or we have y divided by x raised to the power 1 by 4 into y square divided by x square minus 4 raised to the power 3 by 8 into x is equal to c. Hence, on solving the given differential equation, we get y divided by x raised to the power 1 by 4 into y square divided by x square minus 4 divided by 3 by 8 into x is equal to c. So this completes the session. Bye and take care.